hello there. It's been a while. Uh, been a lot of changes. Let's uh, let's go check some stuff out. Homeboy has his own garage now. Look at this. It fits. It barely fits, but it fits. So, yeah. So I've been doing house stuff. It's been uh, it's been quite the quite the journey. So we'll see how things go from here. Um, today I'm gonna end up getting in here and probably washing it off a bit. Uh, a couple of things I've done that I didn't film just because haven't been in the mood for it. Been just trying to get acclimated to being a homeowner. Um, went in and right here in bed line the bed. I don't know if anybody saw on uh, either Facebook or Instagram, but this bed used to look absolutely terrible. But uh, it got a lot of use. I think Daryl put like quads and dirt bikes and stuff in the back here. I mean, used it for its intended purpose, but man, it was all rusted out. And, um, surface rust, not rot though. Um, yeah. So, been trying to get some tires ready and then over here got another set of uh got a set of 300 zx wheels and yeah got some tires last week um went in here and painted some of this a little bit so it doesn't look all scratched up i mean it's still a dented beer can but at least it's not as scratched up as it was there wasn't as much there's like surface rust growing on the bottom down there as far as under the hood over here let's let some light in this bitch under here goes ended up taking out the AC compressor um, and people were like ooh, it didn't have working AC it had been hit in the front when I got it and none of the lines were, pl were plugged in so basically let whatever into the system I wasn't even gonna deal with it I don't need it Whoosh, removed it um, went in here and finally put some clear coat on these fenders this probably isn't the best spot to look at it from but since last time you've seen it, we cut this out, which looks a little bit goofy, but I really don't like how that grill looked. I wanted it cut out. I'm going to figure out how to put something behind it, maybe. Um, did the, the badges in bronze, door handles in bronze. Got this from the last uh, Spirit Peaks event, so it's been since then, come to think about it. It's been since, I think, February? January, February? It's been a while. Man, hits just keep coming. Um, so yeah, let's get it out here and see what we're doing today. One thing I can do now is wash it. <laughs> At some point, I will need to uh, build me some sort of little roll pan like I did on the gray truck. I'm not going to be able to just get a little fill panel uh, like I did with the Nissan. I guess it just seems to be a bunch of either uh, bumpers or bumpers. Oh well. But yeah, I get to go out here and actually wash it up. So, mm hmm, kind of cool. Oh man, there's stuff all over you. Just gonna have to clean you up. Well, so we got it all washed up now. And uh, seems to be a theme at a lot of tracks lately is no leaks, no this, no that. And one thing going against me was that when I first bought this, it had massive valve cover gasket leaks and it's leaked oil all over everything in here. So it doesn't leak now, but it's gonna look like it leaked. It won't drip though. So we got in here, cleaned that guy up. I don't know how good the lighting is. It's all over the alternator, all over the cross member. Get in there. I don't know how well we can see in there. I'll know it'll be sideways. Sorry. That's uh, gonna let it air dry out here for a little bit. It's about mm, probably 75 degrees. Nothing too terrible. But uh, hopefully it doesn't leak and we try to hit some tracks. Whew. All right. So now you can probably see just a little bit better if anybody saw it before how it had all these scratches and stuff on it. 
not perfect, but it looks better from 10 feet than it did before. There was a little spot over here too that looked super terrible. I mean, it was dented and scraped across, so. Small improvements, small improvements. So, yeah, yeah. So we'll see what the next one brings. I'm kind of struggling to figure out how I want this to continue. I know we're gonna be going to some tracks. I originally was gonna go to, I was gonna, just thinking in my head I could, uh, there's supposed to be an October 2nd park that got canceled due to leaks. Awesome. Um, but I was going to go to Spirit Peaks on, sorry, I was going to go to park on October 2nd, Spirit Peaks on October 3rd, I believe, and then Pumpkin Bash on the 9th and do some drag racing Friday night because I drag raced the gray truck, the old Nissan that you haven't seen on the channel. And that thing pulled a 16 flat, which isn't that fast, but keep in mind, single cam KA, no boost, no nothing, just a gear. Um, so I'm curious what the old, uh, what the new 3.4 is going to do, the new hotness. So we'll see how that goes. But now, October 2nd got canceled. I'm battling between going to Parkfest or not, but there's also a financial side of it too. You start, you know, having garages and stuff like that. And <laughs> hard to say what you want to uh, save and what you want to spend but uh looking good so far so mm -hmm. we'll see what we come up with next time have a nice one Whoop.